Hello my dear friends. What we have here is 6 raised to x plus 36 is equal to x raised to x. So let's find out the x. Do you know this rule? If a raised to b plus c then we can write a raised to b into a raised to c. Let's apply this rule here. So we have 6 raised to x into 6 raised to 36 is equal to x raised to x. Now we will divide by 6 raised to x at both the side. 6 raised to x into 6 raised to 36 upon 6 raised to x is equal to x raised to x upon 6 raised to x. This and this will be cancelled. So it will be 6 raised to 36 is equal to x raised to x upon 6 raised to x. Now we can write it like this 6 raised to 36 is equal to x upon 6 whole raised to x. Now we will raise 1 upon 6 at both the side. So we have 6 raised to 36 whole raised to 1 upon 6 is equal to x upon 6 whole raised to x whole raised to 1 upon 6. Now let's remind this rule. If a raised to b whole raised to c then we can write like this a raised to b into c. By applying this rule here we can write 6 raised to 36 into 1 upon 6 is equal to x upon 6 whole raised to x into 1 upon 6. 6 6 are 36 so we can write 6 raised to 6 is equal to x upon 6 whole raised to x upon 6. Now this equation has same base and exponent at both the side. So by using this rule here we can equate 6 is equal to x upon 6. Multiply 6 at both the side. So we have x upon 6 into 6 is equal to 6 into 6. These two will be cancelled. So x is equal to 36 is our answer. Let's put this in the main equation. So our main equation is 6 raised to x plus 36 is equal to x raised to x. 6 raised to 36 plus 36 is equal to 36 raised to 36. 6 raised to 2 into 36 is equal to 36 raised to 36. 6 square whole raised to 36 is equal to 36 raised to 36. So 36 raised to 36 is equal to 36 raised to 36. So x is equal to 36 is the correct answer. Thanks for watching. See you in the next one. Don't forget to subscribe. Bye bye.